here we're asked to find the convolution of e raised to the power of three x and e raised to the power of four x. Looking at our notes below, if f of x and g of x are piecewise continuous on the interval from zero to infinity, then the convolution integral is given here. So to find the convolution of e to the negative three x and e to the four x, we want to evaluate this integral. Notice for our formula, f is the first function and g is the second function. So we'll have the integral from zero to x of f of the quantity x minus tau, which should be e raised to the power of negative three times the quantity x minus tau times g of tau, which should be e raised to the power of four tau. And we integrate with respect to tau, treating x as a constant. Let's go ahead and distribute here and then because we're multiplying in the basis of the same, we can add the exponents. So we'd have the integral from zero to x of e raised to the power of negative three x plus three tau, and then plus four tau, d tau. Notice how we can combine like terms here. So we have the integral from zero to x of e raised to the power of negative three x plus seven tau, d tau. And now we'll have to perform u substitution to evaluate the integral, where we'd have u equal the exponent of negative three x plus seven tau. So u is a derivative of negative three x plus seven tau with respect to tau times d tau, which would be seven d tau, dividing both sides by seven. We have one seventh differential u equals d tau. So we can think of all of this as one-seventh e to the u du, which means the antiderivative is going to be one-seventh e raised to the power of negative three x plus seven tau. And we integrate from tau equals zero to tau equals x. So we'd have one-seventh times and tau equals x we'd have e raised to the power of negative three x plus seven x. And then when tau equals zero, we'd have minus e raised to the power of negative three x. So simplifying, we have one seventh times the quantity. Here we'd have e to the four x minus e to the negative three x. This is the convolution of e to the negative three x and e to the four x. I hope you found this helpful.